what he's doing a video oh a video okay um <clears throat> so i just got a farm sim 19 2019 if you will um looking into getting into modding for it uh so i just wanted to you know <clears throat> we have all these kind of cheats and things for american truck simulator and ets2 and especially as modders like to get more money and get the experience and make sure that our vehicles work as intended uh depending on your level and the whole nine yards and really you don't want to have to play the game for you know 10 12 hours before you can mod for it <clears throat> so i did some searching on the internets and i found out what do you know that there's editing text files hint hint notepad plus plus go get it if you don't have it do it now i feel like they should send me money or something because all i do is advertise for a text editor anywho um yeah so most of the informational things uh that the game runs on are in xml format which is editable by notepad plus plus so if you already have that tool for ats and ets2 you will be able to utilize it for farm sim 19. <clears throat> however today i wanted to show you something that's very controversial apparently in the farm sim uh franchise which is um editing the amount of money that you have to um whatever see if your mods work blah 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 obviously <clears throat> people use it for whatever they want to use it for but I find that it's pretty silly to be upset about that because you bought the game and you do what you want with it, but I don't know. Every video that I've seen on this is everybody, there's no like thumbs up, they're all thumbs down. So if this offends you as a farming simulator enthusiast, my apologies. However. Um, in order to see if any mods that I make work, I'm not going to spend a week getting enough money to buy the mod. So, in case you want to know, here's how to do it. Now we're going to check out, um, the Farm Sim franchise saves information, um, in the... Uh, documents area so you're going to want to go to your computer icon and then go to documents and then you're going to go down to my games right here well, let me turn on my marker that might help in case anybody needs to see it you can see my little pink marker here all right i'm um, going to be right here on my games double click farming simulator 19 double click this is also where you put your mods, by the way, in this folder. Um, so in here, right, so you get your save game and your save, save game one and save game backup. It has three locations for save games, so I'm assuming that when you save something in slot two and slot three, you'll have save game two and three here as well, if that occurs. Now, save game backup are the backups that it creates over time. Like as you, you can set it up to save like every 15 minutes or every time you go into the menu or whatever. Um, so these are those. So these don't matter too much. You don't need to edit anything in here as long as you do it in the save game one or two or three, depending on which, um, slot you're using so we're going to double click this now all these xml's are various and sundry items um, i haven't 
explored all of them. This is just specifically for getting some money um, to be able to take care of uh, buying some mods or whatever um, just to see how they work and so on. Um, you can do with it what you will. Farms XML is the important one. So in my case, I'm going to right click it, open with Notepad++. So we got a whole bunch of different pieces of information here. Um, how many vehicles you have, um, your property maintenance. This just, you know, I, again, I haven't gone through all of these items. Um, like here's one I've sold bales in the amount of that much so far. Just stuff like that. All right. Um, how many wages I've paid out. Um, but the thing in question here, you can edit any number of things. Like here, my farm, you can change that to something different. <clears throat> you can change the color of it. I'm sure there's a... Um, it, somewhere it tells you what color is what, but uh, I don't have any loans. I have input, I have uh, changed the amount of money that I have in the game to this. That's it. You change this line right here. Done. Save it. Right? And then we'll load the game. go to career you can see right here 994 million 636,506 simoleons or whatever the number of units are but that's how you do it it's just an xml edit it's super easy so again i'll show you that you're gonna go to my PC, Documents, My Games, Farming Simulator 2019, Save Game 1 or 2 or 3, depending on what slot you've saved it in. Farms XML, open it in Notepad++, change the money to a unit that you would like to see in your bank account. Uh, that is all for today. Uh, thank you for watching as usual. Um, as I explore more into the farm sim world, I will definitely make videos uh, about modding it, changing it, maybe doing some economy stuff, whatever the case may be. Um, it's a pretty fun game so far, so I'm excited to get into it. And uh, we'll see you guys soon. Thanks so much. See you next time.